Hey everybody, it's the Kerfix and welcome back to the first bonus episode of Let's Play Marduk Chapter 2. <clears throat> In the last episode we beat the uh we beat Marduk. In this episode I'm gonna show off one of the uh two bonus things that you can do in this game. First off, let's we're back in the place where we killed uh, Mark for the first time, so let's read his diary of what he was keeping. Mark's tome. It seems to be filled with rather bad, depressing poetry, or so you assume. It's written in bizarre alien language, though. So that's kind of comical. And uh, up here, you may have noticed the staircase before I fought Morik. There's actually a door up here that you are able to go in. And now, what I assume this place is, well, it's, the so it's Social Fox's tomb. Which is fairly important in the plot stuff, actually. And here we go. Uh, level 14 Phantom. Now, it doesn't seem much at the moment. But it gets bad in here. This is one of the easier bosses, truthfully. Okay, well that wasn't so bad. But this, like, yeah, as I said, this is one of the easier bosses that you're going to be fighting in here. So, You've been warned, basically. You know why am I? Keep, why do I keep looking up his things? I need to. Okay, so power attack. Let's see if this is anything. Nope, it misses. That's cool. Green let it go. Green let it. No, oh, dang it. And Marduk is like that. So let's just finish him off. So that wasn't so bad, but it gets a lot worse in here. Remember the um. Remember the monsters. Uh, I'll show you guys. Encyclopedia. Beastry, or bestiary, monster. Remember these guys? Well, yeah. Wait, do we? Wow, he, we haven't fought a lot of the enemies in this game. Wait, we only fought... Oh, yeah, we, we just fought that guy. <laughs> what the heck am I talking about? Uh, okay, never mind. Uh, okay, yeah, so this is a really, 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 really difficult place. And, yeah, you'll see why in a little bit. Now... In my eyes, like I've I've made I've made a theory about this place, and we get a mind crystal, a blue crystal which is attached to a metal, which is attuned to metal wavelengths and and mind chakras such as that enhances the power of the mind or something like that. Basically, it just decreases your sp your spirit. Okay, here we go. We are fighting these zombie monsters, level fourteen. They are undead. They are not weak to any of these things. Yeah, this is very interesting. Th running into three of them is not the best thing to be running into, so... Let's see if we can finish this off here. They are weak to this. So let's... Yeah, that's nice. Uh, disrupt undead. Nice! Well, that wasn't so hard. Oh, crap. Ooh, go, jeez, that's powerful. Jeez, that's what these guys... That's what those guys can do, and I defended that successfully, too. Holy shnikes. That's powerful than I remember. Holy crap, that's way more powerful than I remember. Oh my god. Did you guys just see that just there? 416 damage, I think that did. 416. But, uh, no, this is a very, very good place to come into. Because Are you kidding me? There's a chest back there. Now, you don't want to have to backtrack ever in this place. Well, that was just for 2,000 gold. God dang it. Okay, we have some more monsters. God. We have the Abominations. Um, I'm not sure. These are kind of like zombies, basically. They're undead, too. Everything here is undead. Uh, except for the Spectres. They're spectral. Um, so these guys have an Onyx Ring, which is very good. And they have a Shadow Blade, which is also a very powerful weapon. And they're weak to fire, so let's try that out. See if that works very well on them. That, okay, well that was not very good timing, but that would have killed them. If I just, if I didn't F it up. So that's cool. Let's use Disrupt Undead on you. Nice, nice. No, Marduk, don't. Urgh, that's powerful. Oh, crap, not Curse. That's not good. Ah, oh, jeez. Um, urgh. Wow, that actually killed it. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to kill it. No, finish him. Finish him, yeah. I actually wasn't expecting it to, I wasn't actually expecting Landon to kill that last abomination there, but that was actually pretty comical. And Marduk mastered Resist Earth, because I'm not keeping the same, um... There we go. Because I'm not keeping the same save file from when I beat the game. 
Yeah, so Marduk just masked with this earth. Ooh, a treasure chest. A better potion. I can't put it in a market sanitary. But as you can see, here's some more use of the map to find some more secret passageways. And I think there's a cutoff? No, but right, right here, so right on this spot here, you really, really want to go there before fighting the boss, because there is a boss that's in here, and you really want to go here. Alright, I'm back. That was just another specter. And here we go. Yes, this is what we needed, a plot item, the Trilobite Key 3. So now, if we look at our plot items, we have 1, 2, 3, and 4. So that will help us. Now we now we have all the Trilobite Keys, by the way. And that will help us for when we do the next bonus episode. So I bet you guys can guess what we're going to do then. It's going to be very fun. Die, monsters, you don't belong in this world. Okay, I'm back. Okay, is there anything down there? There is nothing down there. So... Here we are, at the boss of the Social Fox's tomb, the Zombie Dragon. God, that was powerful already. Um, yeah, so here we are, the Zombie Dragon, level 27, 11,000 HP. It is weak to fire and lightning, and light and spectral attacks. It is undead, so you can use Vern on him. So yeah, let's get this started. Let's get it on, ready, steady, go. Okay. Flame is more powerful on him. Ah, shoot. So this is pretty much just a reskin of the dragon from the first chapter, remember him? He was the, he was the guy who stole my princess. He will never do that again, see? Pwned, man, just pwned. Jeez. Marduk, you're probably going to be better on healing duty than anything else. Oh, jeez. Annoying gas. <laughs> oh, that... Actually, that is extremely annoying. Holy shnikes. Oh, what the heck? Oh, Dugan mastered that. Okay. Oh, let's not use green lightning. Let's use disrupt undead. Oh, that's powerful. Good lord. Annoying gas attack. Oh, shoot. Shoot. God dang it. Um, I guess I'm gonna skip the end of this turn, because she has nothing. Oh, Dugan, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, yes. Swept down dead. Oh, jeez. Okay, 1,000 is good. I think see this guy is actually decently powerful. Then again, we are fighting a dragon, so what else did you guys think? Uh, a zombie... Shoot. Marduk is dead. Oh, shoot. Um... Okay, I guess we're gonna have to just finish this without Marduk, maybe? Blaze. Oof. I'm afraid that if we don't finish this... I fin I'm afraid that if we finish this without Marduk, we're not gonna survive this. Because Marduk is our healer. No, Dugan, don't. Dumb guy. Jeez. Okay, disrupt undead. Finish him. Marduk, you heal yourself right now. Right now. Okay. Stone explosion. Okay, good. Okay, good. That healed Marduk. Thank the Lord Jesus, Grandma. No, that was quoting someone, but who the heck came up? Okay, fine. Dugan, hurt yourself. Oh God. Um, let's do a heal in the entire party. Okay. You're really gonna employ strategy when you fight this guy because he is actually very hard. Okay, Dugan's dead. That's fine. He was just hurt killing us, anyways. It's fine if he's dead. Okay, Vern. It would be very bad if you died, Vern. Frankly. Okay, let's heal up Vern, because I do not want him to die. If he dies, that'd be a very sad thing. Oh, there we go. See? There we go. There we go. See? There we go. That was so stupid. Okay, there you go, Dugan. Or, Dugan. Why do I, keep, why do I call you Dugan? Jeez. Okay. Now, I think what I want to do is I think I want to attack with Vern, get a good action command in, and then attack with Marduk. Or just not. Nah, that's cool. Okay. Well, we're doing this. Whatever. Dark slide. Ooh, that's powerful. Oh, shoot. This is not good. Um... Uh, 200 HP. 
I'm sorry about this, guys. Um, yeah, 200 HP, that seems okay. I don't want to die. Oh, but I spent this much time. Ah, screw it, I'll do 200 HP. Okay, please use stone explosion. Oh, no! God dang it. I died. Well, that sucks. I got to meet you guys back here. Alright, and I'm back. Um, I've pretty much finished him off now. Now I'm just gonna... <clears throat> uh, now I'm just going to off my party members, so... Uh, Marduk may gain more XP. So what is Emma weak to? She is weak to Earth, so let's do some Earth damage on Liana. Oh dang it. Well, she didn't quite kill herself, but... Dugan will definitely kill himself. There we go. <laughs> I always find it hilarious when party members kill themselves. And then Verm, what are you weak to? You're weak to darkness, so let's... Let's use green lightning on you. Boom! But no, okay. So, Marduk, you use heal on Mr. Zombie Dragon and finish it off. Holy crap, 1,172 experience. And here we go, we have the Burial Sword for Dugan, I believe. And land my Master Damage minus 20%. So, shall we equip the Burial Sword? I say we shall. Dugan gains boost and damage plus 30%. It also increases attack by 6. Burial Sword, a decorative but powerful sword that was buried in the Social Fox's tomb, and may or may not belong to him at some point. Um, Dugan has mastered all the things mostly for that. Let's equip him with the Burial Sword, shall we? And give him damage plus 30%. Holy shnikes, that's powerful. And, um, he, uh, he gains more energy when he fights, so, very, very good. I believe we can read this. Maybe not. Okay. So, um, I'm going to teleport out of here because I do not want to. I do not want to uh, risk dying. So yeah, that'll be the bonus episode for today. And stay tuned because there will be another one tomorrow, and there will be a another one the day after that. So, I will see you guys in the next one. See you all later. Peace out.